And Corey, one thing that the psychology professors do is we line up after graduation and people come off the stage and shake each, each person's hand to congratulate them. So may I? <laughs> one more person. Congratulations. that he couldn't attend the physical graduation. My other son, Michael, shared with him is that mom's already taken care of that. She sent a letter or an email to the dean of students, Jeff Klaus, and he was kind enough to get all this, to get all this put together for me. And he sent an email out to all the faculty, and uh, Courtney Ar Aarons, I believe, uh, said she'd be glad to come out, and he, uh, the dean of students, Jeff Klaus, said he'd come out. And then I was very surprised to find out the president was going to come out and Dave Whitney. This, I mean, it was very, very overwhelming and at the same time really heartwarming because he has worked so hard. Corey has paid for his schooling all himself and it was just very important to him to, to make sure he get, got his diploma. This year we graduated, we granted almost 10,000 degrees and we think that about 8,000 students walked and so I did shake every hand. Um, but I miss Corey. This is a, such an illustration of how um, student affairs and academic affairs work together and how close we are with the families of our students and how we value our newest alums and we want Corey to know that personally. I really was honored to have known him at this point and I, and I mean that. I see somebody who will be okay. And I know that as his career goals, many of his career goals that he was talking about was to go on in psychology, to be able to help other people. And so I can see him still doing that and becoming a fantastic mentor for other people who may have gone through traumatic experiences. He plans on going to grad school. That is one of his priorities. I, I have to go to grad school, Mom. That was something I wanted to do, I'm going to continue to do. And I said, Corey, you can do and be whatever you want. You are very resourceful, resilient, you know, he's just got this huge heart and as you can tell by the number of people that have showed up, 